Thompson. All right, well, Thompson kicks to half forward. Menzel, it slips through his fingertips for Adelaide. Scrambly play opposite where we're broadcasting. Perfect conditions for football. Hand pass comes wide there. It'll be taken by McKenzie for Norwood. His kick, oh, Wilson took the mark. No, he didn't. He flew high. Teammates going to grab it. That's rookie. A rookie across towards where running through is Wilson. Wilson on the move. Has a bounce. He's a fair distance away from goal. He has another bounce. He's at 50. Wilson, give it to me. Into the forward pocket. Marked by door down. This is a good side too. That's McGovern who took the grab at halfback. Goes to Cheney. He runs forward. He'll go for the short pass to centre wing. It's marked by the tall timber there, Riley O'Brien. Over the top into the centre. Could be one extra hand pass. It went in the finish towards Dean Gore, who had it. Come to mind that uh, three to four weeks away between them. But Norwood, have, they've got what they've got in the middle at the moment. But again, it looks like the Crows will get the turnover. Though Thompson, a little slow on the pickup, caught holding the ball. And once he releases, it will be Norwood to go forward. Mitch Grigg. Being one of the Norwood ball magnets this season. He finds Joffa Jeffries on the McKenzie, who has not scored a goal at Sandful level. He has now. Football, he's been for Melbourne and for the Crows. He's been super, super. He's McKenzie, who kicked the last goal. He wobbles the kick to hold, towards half forward. Giannini takes it for Norwood. Swings around on the right boot. Norwood got up. No. Hand pass will come clear in the finish to the man we're talking about. Thompson, oh, he gave it away. He gave it away. Shot for goal is through. Fair I don't reckon that was, was that the first quarter. We haven't even hit time on as yet. Bit of a collision of bodies there. As it is Signorella who's ducked and tackled high for mine. Umpire says no, not high. Crows will come forward. That's Jarman. Kicks long down towards half forward. Giorgio rushes back, favoured by a good bounce. Hand pass was slick and most importantly accurate to full up. Fuller's kicking to the middle. Norwood looking good with this move forward through Weber. Weber bangs the ball towards Johnston, who takes the mark. Two kicks out. Skips back. Looks for Dorr. He goes the hand pass. Dorr's running back into the square and saying, kick it to me. And the ball is kicked over his head for goal. Pass out of the middle. It'll go towards Wilson. He'll have to knock it forward or just run. Let him go. Get out of his way. Grig now goes for the hand pass. Wilson's going to have to be quick. He is. Is he going to be slippery? Yes. He goes backwards. He goes forwards. He kicks backwards. He did it well. Maintained his composure. And the ball went to Bartlett. And Bartlett just went chipping nice and steady. Marked by McKenzie. McKenzie, 19 gone in this turn. McKenzie, not sure what to do. Well, I don't know if that was meant or not, but the... Got on goal to take the lead. 28 minutes gone at Woodville. We'll keep an eye on that. But right now with Giannini to get... to tie this one up at Norwood. Giannini, drop punt kick on its way. Here's a goal! Score. Oh, these games have been really, really interesting with the closest of the scores. Ethan Haylock, the game-winning goal for the Eagles. Well, he's kicked the goal and he'll be adulated by all and sundry. Balderstone swings out of the pack. The big man, the big bull. He's to sit for him, 45 out. He goes back to Hunter. His kick inside, forward 50, looking for Paholke. Spills to Signorella by the boundary line. Desperate tackle by Forster. What has happened? Let's see if Norwood can gain some respite at halfback. Giannini kicks across towards the centre of the ground. Wilson comes in, has it, and goes for a run. Go, go, go. One bounce. Through the middle. Go again. That's two. Go again. Go for three. Have a long kick. He does. He drives long. Goal of the day. Goal of the moment. OK, that's the main thing. Seisman got the tap down and got the kick away through Himmelberg. Now uh, Norwood trying to reset Giorgio. Playing a little bit of a sweeper. Gridiron fan, Pete, don't like that term quarterback. They don't throw it. <laughs> He's not a quarterback. Sweeper is for mine. It's Lavecki. He does switch play across the other side to Bauer. Bauer kicks it into space. This is smart. Backs himself. The Red Legs are not going to die wondering as he kicks it and pinpoint pass to Wilson. Wilson wastes no time. Goes towards Cooper's pocket and has found it. It is Adelaide by four points. 25 gone in your with Peter Walsh. Oh, it's a tight one. Ball tossed in the air. Stands for Riley O'Brien. No, not quite. Hand pass or flick to Jarman who lost it. Scrambly play in the middle. Thompson goes in for the Crows. He gets some support from Gallucci. Off the ground, he doesn't travel too far. Hand pass comes clear. Now, there's a lot of pushing going on. And the umpire's going to play. 
For the Crows, it is about winning, but there's other things that come into the equation as well. So losing for those supporters doesn't hurt as much. Signorello and um, Jeffries bounce off each other. It spills to Smart. Too far out to score, maybe. Runs to 55. Wormburn a kick door. Oh, 19 minutes have gone. We're back in the middle. Cooper Stadium under some beautiful moonlight. O'Brien, the tap to Thompson, who's battling with Weber. Thought he threw out the arm there. Trying to wind down the clock. It's been a seven-goal quarter, 21 and a half. Gone of it. One point the margin. Norwood the clearance. The high kick towards the edge of the centre square. And a mark to Dorr. He's got the run. Here comes the kick. It's from Grigg. It's going to go through. It's Johnson.